If you ain't a body cancer with me, I swear that these bitches my mini me's. He wanna sex, niggas be dreaming. I'm finna ex, niggas be scheming. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Mocha Michelle, and I'm back with another video. Welcome if you're new here, and welcome back if you've been true here, baby. I'm here with a vlog today. Here to deliver the vlog today. No, I'm joking. I look a mess again today, y'all. Yeah, I do, I do. I'm running errands. I'm taking Taylor to the doctor today. She's going to go to ortho, following up with her wrist. Um, speaking of that, let me just make sure I have the disc from from um okay from urgent care i have that because i would forget my head if it wasn't attached to my show my own neck y'all so yeah we're going to ortho i'm taking y'all with me um and then if there's time i'm gonna run the burlington coat factory before i pick lily up from the bus stop because i want to see if i can find some things for the girls so i'll see you guys in the next clip when we get to the doctor all right y'all that's my first time pushing the stroller i'll show y'all when we get in the building it's too crazy out here Always in me, Commonwealth, Lil Joe, getting love from my city. Yeah. I roll call for the DMV. In my own lane, you could still ride with me. Yeah. Lord knows I made mistakes. You won't end, but it's too late. I don't need your support just to know I'm important. And I won't ever sell myself short, cause I know you will see me on the come up. Big girl with big dreams and big drip Talk is cheap, but please dare me to run up I'ma put my money where my mouth is Talk a good game, I'm an alpha babe Even on my worst days, still an alpha babe Standing next to me, you gotta be an alpha babe Eight ball in your pocket a broken arm All right mm. you want them to give you a cast yeah. and Taylor has her cast off mm. and she's I don't know she's doing a lot hey. check in with y'all when we get out of here in me, Commonwealth, Lil Joe, getting love from my city. Yeah. I roll call for the DMV. In my own lane, you could still ride with me. Yeah. No one knows I made mistakes. You won't end, but it's too late. I don't need your support just to know I'm important. And I won't ever sell myself short, cause I know you'll see me on the come up. Big girl with big dreams and big drips. Y'all, I just came. We just came out of there, and I'm about to head to. I'm gonna pick my son up so I can run in Burlington Coat Factory because I feel like the kids is gonna be sleeping by the time I get over there. Taylor was tired, um, but if they're not sleeping, they could all come in the store with me. And Taylor's arm wrist is not really broken. Um, I saw the X-rays and. Her bone is just a little like bruised, I guess. And she has a brace, a brace that could come on and off that um, she has to wear for three weeks. And they said she don't have to follow up because it's not a bad 
um, it's not really a break. So that's good to know. Thank you, Jesus. No cast or nothing. So um, I also ran into a friend of mine. Well, we weren't friends, but we used to work together. She was real nice to me when I was pregnant with um, Milani. So it was nice that she got to actually meet Milani because I Milani was in my stomach when I was working with her. Um, a lot of people that I used to work with have expanded out into like the medical um, field or just like doing better things. Not saying that working at the group home wasn't a good thing, but it's just they're advancing in their careers and I just love to see it. I can't wait till it's my turn, y'all. But I will see you guys um, when we get in Burlington Coat Factory. I'm about to head out of here. Where did I have to put my AirPods? Okay, I'm about to head out of here. Yeah, it was so hard trying to what's on my coat. It was so hard trying to vlog in um Brothers and Co Factory. <laughs> I kid you not, okay? I kid you not. Um it was, I didn't really find anything in there. Um I bought some Nibia shower gel and I found Milani some crocs with the fur in it. Cause she always wanna wear her crocs anyway. I didn't find Malia or Taylor no Crocs. I found Milani and Taylor matching pair of sneakers. Um, and I picked up just like a couple of outfits for them. I put them on layaway. I know y'all like who does layaway, but they don't need the stuff that I picked out right now. It's spring stuff, so. But I just wanted to make sure they have it. So I'll pick it up. And when I pick it up, I'll show you guys what I got. But, hmm? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You like that one or you like the fire one? I like both of them. Yeah, yeah. I'm sitting here at the bus stop and I'm about to um pick up because the girls got like crumbs and paper in my back seat and it just looks disgusting. So one day next week I'm gonna have to take my car to the car wash, take the car seats out the car and um get my car wash, wash the car seats and put them back together. I hate doing that, but or wipe them down with um, disinfectant stuff and spray it down and clean it like that. Um, yeah, just get my car clean because it's just ridiculous. I also got like so many air fresheners. I got these out my brother's car. My brother had like so much air fresheners. Like when I tell you I'm good, I'm good. I'm good for a long time. I can't even pick them up. Okay. Period. We got, you see all these? You see all these? Most of them are bubble gum and I love bubble gum. Spice Market. Hmm? Heat. I never, oh, you can. Okay, I smell cinnamon -y. Yep, they see your gum. I smell cinnamon -y. Spice Market. This kind of smell good. This smell like a um candle like cabin or something. All right, we know how bubble gum smell. Heat. I always wanted to know how this one smelled. Wait a minute, baby. What? It's not a scratch and sniff either. True North. Pina Colada. We can't smell that one. Morning Fresh. I think I smelled that one before. Yeah, that's it. Just a bunch of um, the same ones. Yeah, so get my car cleaned out. Put my little smell goods in. And call it a day. What? What? Chew it. I'm tired, y'all. Um, what's today? What am I doing today? I don't know what I'm cooking. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know anything. I had something to tell y'all, but I don't. What do you want to spit it out? Yes or no? I have something important to talk to y'all about, but let me get a um. Let me get a wipe. But I kind of just really can't even remember. It was important too. Here. 
Oh, I think it was my hair store experience this morning. I tried to return something and I had the receipt. I didn't want my money back. I just wanted a simple like store credit, get something in the store. They gave me such a hard time and did not take the item back, which is offensive to me because I'm there all the time. Like I shop there all the time and Mommy. what? Your what? It's right here in the front. Y'all, right here in the front. Where? Right here in the front. Where? Right next to you? Yeah, next to me. I shop there all the time, and that's how they're going to do me. Like, y'all know those people I'm talking about. They don't ever want to, like, they so mean to black people, but they need our business, you know? They need our business. We make their business bump. We the ones buying the weave, the hair stuff, the beads, the grease, all that stuff. Like we in there, not not them. We keep them in business and they treat us like crap. So I'm not supporting that store no more. What? I'm not supporting them no more. I'm not buying, I have to find another place to buy um, the kids beads and hair stuff. And I have to find another place to buy my stuff from because I'm not going in there no more. They done drew the last the last line with me. Okay? Yeah. Leave her chips alone. Here. And I'm tired of that. Like, I'm tired of spending my money with people. And they don't appreciate it. Or any of us. You know, not all of, not all of us come in there and um, still. So... Why is your screen black? Hold on, y'all. We haven't hit this with difficulties. What did you do? I don't know what this girl did. Her screen is black. Taylor. What the heck? How though? I'm gonna turn it off and turn it back on. That that might be what we need to do. Yeah. What do I have to do today? Um. Oh, you know what? I need to make a freaking phone call. Yeah. Give me. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Hold on, 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 I'm trying to solve this dilemma. What dilemma? Taylor's iPad. Dilemma? That's what I know. How come I'm going to be doing so much? Um. Um. Yeah, they got crumbs all in my car. It's just crazy right now. Um, Y'all don't know what to do with my hair. So I dyed my real hair honey blonde. And it's just hard to find, like, any hair that matches that hair. So I need to order some new wigs. <sighs> I'm tired of the wigs that I have. Like, I'm just tired of them. I've had them. It's time for new stuff. So I just don't even know what I want to do with my hair right now. I think I'm just about to wash this wig and just keep it on for a little while until I find what I want. Um, I usually order from Ebony Line and they got like thousands and thousands and thousands of wigs and I fall asleep just like Sheen. I fall asleep shopping and putting stuff in my cart because it's a job, okay? And when you have so many choices, it's like I don't need a lot of choices because I'm a very confused person. Don't give me a bunch of choices because I make confusion out of everything I do. Everything is confusion, okay? Down to decorating my house. Down to which way I should lay this or which way I should turn the couch. Where I should put the table. Like, everything is just major confusion. So, yeah. Mom, I see, all the, I see all the 
see all the bugs. Huh? I see all the bugs. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'm going to make my phone call that I need to make. And tomorrow I have my one on one with Jazz, just Jazzy. Um, I'll let you guys know how that goes. I also, see, I got a lot to do. Yeah, I'm gonna go home and wash my hair. And I need to craft a little bit because Valentine's Day is Tuesday. And I'm working this weekend, so I'm not going to really have too much time. I am going to have time, like, when I get home to put their gifts together and stuff. But I be tired when I get home, too. And I have to feed them, give baths, and all of that stuff. Tomorrow, I need to go to the grocery store before my one-on-one. Um, -on -one. Hopefully, I can get in and get out and get home one time. But, yeah, I need to... Um, you see how I was just rubbing my eye right now? It felt so good. And I don't have lashes on, okay? This is why I don't want lashes on my eyes 24-7. I need to rub my eye. That felt so good. <laughs> that felt so good. I'm sorry, y'all. But, yeah. Um, I need to get some groceries for the weekend to make my life easier when I get off work this weekend. Because, woo, do I be all over the place with dinner and up late and back up early. I wish the the kids that would take them overnight from Friday to Sunday that will make working and doing everything a lot easier for me what he does not he can't say nothing about her dad and I'm not even saying nothing bad about him I'm just saying I wish he would take them from Friday to Sunday Friday 5pm to Sunday 5pm that would be clutch okay clutch. oh my god manifest it we, we manifest it um yeah because i have to get them ready in the morning drop them off and get myself ready in the morning like and get to work on time like that's crazy to me like that's mad difficult then i would just like let him get them dressed but that's gonna be difficult too because i don't know taylor has eczema and i would like for her to be lotioned really good or it's gonna be a problem all day what What orange thing? Oh, you can't have none of that, honey. It's mine. <laughs> it's it's what? mine. What is it? Anyway, y'all, yeah, the struggle, okay? It's a straight up struggle, I swear. Every day, every day is hard. Every day I'm hustling, okay? Every day I'm hustling. Literally. And my landlord think he getting his rent money. You got like seven things in that house to fix. And you still didn't give me my receipt from the other rent money I, I've given you. Like, and I asked him if he could give me my receipts so I could have them. No, he's yet to find time to bring me my receipt or come and fix the damn smoke detective or fix my door that he's supposed to be fixing. Like everything, I'm just tired of being treated like that. Like you're not gonna get the rent money until you fix what you need to fix. Because why am I supposed to be professional and you don't have to be professional? I'm confused here, like I'm really tired. So it's like, I have the rent money, but you can, are you gonna fix my stuff so we could live comfortably? Cause what are we paying rent for if we can't live comfortably? So that'd be one thing after another, but I always demand my respect and I'm gonna demand my respect with that. That's why a lot of people don't like me because I demand my respect. You gonna respect me, you gonna respect me. And that's just it. You're gonna respect me. You're gonna get away from me. But no, seriously, why am I paying rent one time? And the stuff in my house is just messed up and you got, oh, I forgot. Or why didn't you remind me? Or who the fuck are you talking to? Remind you to do what? I'm not your assistant. I can be if you pay me, but I don't remind you. I don't remind you to have multiple properties. Like, let me just stop it. Okay, let me stop. I'm going left. I'm going to end the video here, y'all. I'm tired and I'm babbling and I'm, I'm just, it's just a lot of stuff going on. Huh? What? Oh, I ain't got no more chips. I only bought one bag. And that one bag was for her. And I got you your little gum and your little candy. So, yeah. I tried. Oh, y'all. I enjoyed, before I go, I enjoyed my little stroller um thing today. Milani, did you enjoy the stroller? Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it made my life much easier. I just want to say, I don't know what is on my coat, but it's like white. Um, it made my life much easier 
I don't know why I wasn't taking that stroller out Mommy. in the first place. You know, like Mommy. Taylor weighs in the house. <laughs> and you're gonna make me a burger. She got this from um, Burlington Coke Battery. She always plucking you. I want a burger. These burgers are my favorite foods. One of my favorite foods, okay? I want a burger and I want a soda. And I want some ketchup on my fries, okay? Okay. Okay. I, I just want to hold it up here because you know when we get out the car, you never want to hold anything. So I'm just trying to have everything together. I'm completely, oh, I must say I completely forgot what we were talking about. Oh, 14 minutes, this vlog gonna be long just because of this. <laughs> just because of this, y'all, but I enjoyed um, having our stroller today and it, it was the first time, it was a new experience and I just, I loved it. Um, it's in the trunk right now. No, when we get in the house, you can open it. I'm definitely gonna make good use of that. Taylor does like being strolled around. Um, and I just probably need to take them for walks or just take them to the mall and walk around the mall maybe. Just do little things with them to keep them busy because they're so little and they just, they want air, but they also don't want to walk too much. And Milani, y'all saw, saw she was standing. I don't know if y'all saw her in any clips where she was sitting, but she's like, well, I want to stand up. Well, I want to sit down. Well, I got to put my seatbelt on. Well, like, and I got mad compliments on the stroller today. Everybody was like, whoa, that's nice. You know, like, because they know how toddlers Milani age. They, they be too tired to walk, but too big to carry. So she's at that age where she's just too big to carry, but she gets tired. She can't walk for long distances. So that stroller was definitely an investment and I'm glad I bought it. And that's all I got to say. Um, if you have kids that are like Taylor's one and Milani's three, but Taylor will be two in two months. So if you have kids that are like that age gap, get, get that stroller, get that stroller. It costs a lot, but it will make your life easier. Okay, for real. Cause I'm about to start living. We about to start doing things and you know, they can always get in the stroller. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe and turn on your notification bell. So you know, every time I post a video, I am going to start posting my social, you know what? It'll be in the description. All my social medias, make sure y'all following me on and keeping up with me. I don't post on Instagram, but I'm going to start posting on Instagram and I'm gonna start trying to post on TikTok and Facebook. And just being more active because I don't post pictures. And that's probably why my channel is growing slowly. I think I need to put myself out there more and it'll grow faster. So, yeah, y'all. That's the goal for 2023. Love y'all. And make sure y'all stay tuned for my next video. Okay? Bye. If you ain't a body can't sit with me. I swear that these bitches my mini-me's. He wanna sex. Niggas be dreaming. I'm from the ex. Niggas be scheming.